another video. If you weren't here, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you need the day, and turn on your post notification bell so you'll be notified every single time I post baby, okay? Um, uh, today's video, as you can tell, is a get ready with me for my sister's birthday. We're going out to go, you know, celebrate her tonight. So I'm just gonna be going through like getting ready with me, talking a little bit here and there, a little chit chat. So if you wanna see how this look came about. Think I'm hanging girl. Okay, first things first. Shower. Whew. Okay. Now, skin. So my skincare and using the necessary um, unscented lotion. Oh my God. Using this and this together. This is kind of all together. Ten ten. I'm gonna wash my face just one more time before, cause I was like having a mental breakdown um, earlier today, and I'm like, crying my face is just like, mm. so I could just, I just wanna wash it off and just move on. So <sighs> my emotions are all over the place, and I had to just accept something that I haven't had it accept yet, accepted yet. And um, I just today officially accepted it and really got that closure. So, Okay, so let me just put on some Andy on my lips. Just some um, my lips on my chat while I do my hair and makeup. And I'm going very soft, not doing too much. I'm just going to the bowling alley, I believe, with a hard rock. Let's see. One of the two. Either way. Soft makeup and just throwing something quick on. Um for my hair, I'm just gonna be using this. Put my brush. And yeah, I'm just gonna straighten my wig that I got on. Right, I'm using the Infinity Pro by Calm here. And then some of this Garnier. Um what is it called? Marvelous Wool. I'm almost done so down here, so. I would love this stuff. So let me let that heat up and then yeah. Oh I gotta grab my makeup box. I mean my makeup bag. What's it? I got a special delivery. Oh my god, y'all. This is like the sweetest thing ever. I can't look me up in here. Let me put them on. What? Are you kidding me? Oh M G. Oh my god, and they smell so good. Like I never received something like this before. Shout out to Sophie, my girl. If she if you're watching this right now, girl, hey girl, I love you. Thank you so much for sending me this, y'all. I told y'all I've been having been going through a lot of emotional breakdowns and like just a lot of mental emotional things and just a lot going on right now in my personal life um so uh, i was talking to, to her the other day and she just made me feel better and she told me she was sending me something but i was not expecting it to be this like 
I can't, I just, it made my, the rest of my week, so it made me feel so much better, and um, yes, of course, granted, I was going through it today, but that's just because I'm just an emotional wreck, but overall, I'm feeling better than I did the other day, so, um, yeah, shout out to her, she's so sweet, like, the sweetest, they smell, like, I don't know, I don't, I don't, how can roses smell like this, it's not like a, a luxury perfume, like, I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put it. I probably put it on my bookshelf or maybe when I get my vanity, I'm gonna probably put it there. But yeah, it's just, a, it's a moment, it's a piece. It's so me. Like, thank you, baby. So, I just wanted to share my special delivery. Um, and we're about to get started on hair and makeup, baby. Okay, so I'm about to start my hair. So, I guess we could chat for a little bit while I um, get my hair together. So, let's chat, let's chat for a little bit. Um, I've been, like I said, just um, having a lot of emotional um, breakdowns and um, just trying to cope with a lot of things. And um, yeah, I've just been kind of like emotionally absent with myself and like just finally had I guess that breakdown that I probably needed and just needed to cry and just like let it out um also like I said I just had to accept something that I hadn't accepted yet or didn't have never had the chance to accept um and get closure with so um yeah that's another thing that kind of like put me through the motions today um, and it's really not like, no, like bad, whatever, anything like that. It's just, um, the fact that I just had to realize that today, um, and just come to terms with that it is what it is, you know, um, regardless of how, how I truly feel or felt, um, there's nothing I can do about it. And it's just something that clearly needed. Like I asked for closure for, with, I asked for closure. Um, but I feel like we, it depends on how you're doing things and what you're doing, what you're doing to get that closure. Um, so it's just funny how God works. Like, it's just like, that was my closure. Like, okay, I see, I see what you're doing. So I can't be mad at it. So at the end of the day, it's life. It's the whole point of experiencing. It's the whole point of, um, dating, whole point of falling in and out of love and knowing a person and not knowing them anymore. Um, so yeah, that's just another, so it's just, yeah. But anyway, I don't really want to talk about it because I really don't want to even think about it no more because I've been crying my eyes out. Like I'm just, please. <laughs> Mental health, everything, like emotional, roller coasters, all that stuff. Y'all know, like sometimes you just gotta have that moment to yourself and just, really analyzing um self-reflect so that's kind of like what i had to just go through for the past few days and understand what's, what was happening so i'm gonna put a few drops of this on my hair real quick just to give it some shine give it some life and we're gonna run through it real quick so i can move on to my makeup real quick I don't, what time is it 4 10 okay yeah i need to be leaving at like five so, and this hair is a little, it's a little greasy. I shouldn't even put, have put that oil in there. But it is cool though. I don't even mean trip. It's not that serious. Make sure y'all take the time out to check in with yourself because if you don't, um, that can really cause a lot of built up um, emotion and, um, whatever, like you'd be mad, sad, hurt, angry, uh, whatever it is. In my case, I'm not, I'm not angry, I wasn't angry. Um, it's just more like more of you, like sad and like, wow, like, okay. It's more like that, but. It'll all be okay, y'all, at the end of the day. Just make sure you check in with yourself. Don't lose yourself, because it's, it's a big thing, losing yourself. Um, self-destruct and stuff like that is just is real 
and that's just something I had to face and now I'm trying to just overcome it and like move, move past it. The past is the past. Um, I can't keep trying to relive it or um, get that same feeling back that I used to have and stuff like that. Like I have to just make space and make openness for new experiences and new um, things, you know, new relationships, friendships, all that good stuff. So, yeah. Also getting closure um, from stuff in the past too is also good. If you never get the closure, if you will always have that feeling that I'm deep down somewhere, which will kind of block you from um, allowing other people to love you and um, show up for you and you know you to love them and be whether it's a friendship, relationship, um, family, doesn't matter. Just closure is super important. And that's something I was looking for for a long time and like waiting around for that I just never got and just been direct with it. And then like when you go look for it in a different type of way or like in your own way, sometimes it don't work like that. And then like today, like God just showed me like, okay, all right, bet. So I'm glad I got that closure and um, just gotta move on. Can't keep dwelling on it. <laughs> so I'm gonna pass in how I wanna, want it to feel and like memories and a whole bunch of stuff that don't even matter no more. Gotta just go with what goes with you. Be where you need to be and um, love on who loves you and things like that. This is my little TED talk. This hair, y'all. This hair is so greasy. Y'all do not talk about my lace. I'm not playing. I would lay it down and all that stuff, but I just don't. I don't feel like it. Good hair. It's like it's washed and like don't have like a product on my product in it. It's really good for us. I had this wig. This is my wig from my birthday. A topic that I've been seeing a lot of girls talk about lately is like knowing when to move on and like when to leave and stuff like that. And like getting over past situations and relationships. Um yeah, like knowing when to is definitely important um and also closure like i said from past things past relationships things that you probably never truly got over um also very important for just the now like when you're doing things in the now and you still kind of got that somewhere lingering on in the back of your heart or your head or your whatever that's another thing that can keep you from not seeing what's in front of you and not enjoying what's in front of you truly like you enjoy it but you don't fully take it in you know um, the next step makeup my favorite part <laughs> a little bit less they would so keep that in mind 
if they wanted to, they would. If they wanted to talk to you, they would. If they wanted to keep up with you, they would. Um, if they wanted to make you feel special, they would. Spend time, anything. That goes for friendships, relationships, family, anything. Never feel like anybody is too, like, because of a title, you can't cut them off or let them go out of your life. They showing you they don't really mess with you like that? You gotta just accept it. So, um, recently just had to, you know, tell myself, like, know your worth. <laughs> Girl, you worth it. Like, you worth it. No matter what, no matter who gave up on you, no matter who doesn't want to deal with you or be involved with you, talk to you, be friends with you, be cool with you, nothing. Just know that you're worth it, and one day, you, the people that's supposed to be around you will be around you. So, don't always be waiting around to um, rekindle friendships, old relationships, anything like that, because you'll just be waiting around, and they're busy doing their own, own thing, and they worry about their own life. They don't care about how you feel, so... Chestnut by Elf. We're going to follow up with Hourglass in Maple. Or this is in Saffron, Warm Saffron. Yeah, happy birthday, sis. If you're watching this, Team Libra, I love Libras. They are like the sweetest. I love Libras so much. Also, I'm gonna add just a little bit of this brown in my crease. Just for a little bit of damage. Just a little bit. Yes, this is the Jaclyn Hill um, Army Gorgeous. Cashmere sweater top. I don't know if I'm wearing these Sarah tights. It's like a olive green fallish green look. Or just a pair of blue jeans with my dunks. Either way, I'm wearing my dunks, but well, maybe not. I might wear my Yeezys. But I really don't want to show my toes because I have my toes done this weekend. So. Yeah. So, either way, I'm going bowling, so I'm probably should wear sneakers anyway, so I can have socks on. My top is on. She's cute. I think I'm going to go with these. This is the fit. I'll try to insert some pictures if I get a picture. I probably, I'm not running the picture move, y'all. Okay, y'all, so this is the end of the video. I am done getting ready. Thank y'all so much for hanging out with me and chatting with me for a little bit, or hearing me chatting for a little bit. Let me know what y'all think, what y'all thoughts, thoughts are, what y'all opinions are, what I was talking about in this video. If you made it all the way to the end, thank you so much for tuning in. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Love y'all.